Hello everyone, you are in Endurance Laser Lab, where I keep experimenting with our solar panels. We have solar panel that is installed here and a laser 10 watt with a MO2 PC board. So what is really interesting here I want to show you. So the first thing that we showed previously that solar panels, they are pretty good for measuring uh, pulses and uh, you can see here that uh, uh, we have second channel this one is on transistor and here is on uh, solar panel and you can see that on one kilohertz it works pretty much uh, equal so you see a start of a signal and you have a drop we made a little modification on our solar panel. We added uh, a resistor of uh, 100 ohm. So now we are going to increase frequency to 10 kilohertz. Ilya, let's increase it to 10 kilohertz. So the laser and uh, solar panel, they work good on those frequencies. The signal will be a little bit different because we need to measure uh, how current is increasing and uh, now, now I will show you that we have some, some problems here. So we have uh, yeah, yeah, no, no, actually, on one, on, on 10 kilohertz, we have pretty good uh, parameters. So you see that it's increasing. So it's a question for us if um, this increasing is on a diode, on laser, or on solar panel. So we plan to make some improvements next to use photodiode to measure and uh, also add. Um, We'll, we'll think how to measure real current on diode, how it's, it's increasing, so that will be important. And here is our transistor signal. Okay, let's increase to uh, 100, 100 kilohertz. So, and you see the laser is still working. We run it on uh, that frequency and 1%. Okay, we have a generator here where you can change duty ratio and you can change frequency. Okay, what we have on oscillograph. Yeah, so it's it's a good, you know, it's a good picture actually. So you see that transistor is open and we see that it's increasing so for for yeah it's it has duration of a signal is uh, 800 nanoseconds so maybe a little bit less maybe one millis, uh, microsecond in general and here we see that it's dropping uh, after one uh, microsecond it starts dropping so the, the big question is uh, to see real real picture of a uh, laser how it's increasing uh, how the actually current is increasing on diode and then to see real uh, diode output so we plan to use um, we plan to use photo photo diodes to make that measurements so we'll keep you updated about our progress but the main thing that we wanted to show you that laser uh, diode laser can easily work on frequency 100 kilohertz and solar panel for measurement of your pulses can also work on 100 kilohertz so uh, that's basically wanted to show you and share if you have anything to share with us and you have some comments please uh, type them under this video share it uh, and join our Facebook community and visit our website endurancelasers.com and endurance-lasers.com have wonderful experimenting uh, experience with endurance bye bye